CDTV.net Dividend Report is brought to you in part by 1M3 Corporation, IT Solutions for Banking and Finance. Call them at 917-686-3485. That's 917-686-3485. I'm John Hanna, and here are the CDTV.net Dividend Report for Friday, April 3, 2009. But first, here's today's CDTV.net Top Stories. Unemployment rate jumped to 8.5% in March, the highest since late 1983. Employers eliminated 663,000 jobs. If part-time and discouraged workers are factored in, the unemployment rate would be 15.6% in March, the highest since 1994, according to Labor Department data. The average work week in March dropped to 33.2 hours, a record low. Since December 2007, the economy has lost a total of 5.1 million jobs, with about two-thirds of the losses occurring in the last five months. Lindsay Corporation reported net earnings were $200,000 or one penny per diluted share compared to $9.7 million or 79 cents per diluted share in the prior fiscal year's second quarter. Total irrigation equipment revenues decreased 41% to $48.4 million from $82.6 million in the prior fiscal year's second quarter. Gross margin was 20.4% compared to 27.7% a year ago. Lindsay Manufactures and Markets Irrigation Equipment primarily used in agricultural markets, which increases or stabilizes crop production while conserving water, energy, and labor. Cascade Corporation reported excluding the asset impairment charge, net income was $1.1 million or $0.10 per diluted share in the fourth quarter fiscal 2009 compared to net income of $8.8 million or $0.74 per diluted share for the fourth quarter of fiscal 2008. Net sales of $95.1 million for the fourth quarter fiscal 2009 were 30% lower than net sales of $136.2 million for the prior year fourth quarter. Company will take steps to adjust operations like reduction of global workforce by 20%, 10% reduction in salaries, pay and hiring freezes, reduce work schedules, and spending controls. Cascade Corporation is a leading international manufacturer of materials, handling products used primarily on lift trucks. Global Payments Incorporated reported diluted earnings per share grew 2% to 45 cents compared to 44 cents in the prior year quarter. For the third quarter, revenues grew 26% to $392.7 million compared to $310.6 million in the prior year. Global Payments Incorporated is a leading provider of electronic transaction processing services. And now, the dividend report. Southwest Georgia Financial Corporation announced that its board of directors suspended its quarterly cash dividend. Southwest Georgia Financial Corporation is a state-chartered bank holding company with approximately $276 million in assets. English Markets Incorporated announced that its board of directors has declared a cash dividend of $0.16.5 per share on all of its Class A common stock and $0.15 per share on all of its Class B common stocks. The dividends on both of the Class A and Class B common stock are payable April 23rd to all shareholders of record on April 9, 2009. English Markets Incorporated is a leading supermarket chain with operations in six southeastern states. Atlantic Coast Federal Corporation announced that its board of directors has declared a quarterly cash dividend of a penny per share versus nine cents per share last quarter. The dividend will be paid on April 27 to all stockholders of record as of April 10, 2009. Atlantic Coast Federal Corporation is the holding company for Atlantic Coast Bank, a federally chartered and insured stock savings association. J.C. Penny Company Incorporated announced that its board of directors declared a quarterly dividend on the company's common stock of 20 cents per share. The dividend is payable on May 1st to stockholders of record at the close of business on April 9, 2009. J.C. Penney is one of America's leading retailers. The board of directors of Darden Restaurants declared a quarterly cash dividend of 20 cents per share. 
The dividend is payable on May 1st to shareholders of record at the close of business on April 10, 2009. Darden Restaurants Incorporated is the world's largest company-owned and operated full-service restaurant company. For more information about these dividends and other announcements, go to cdtv.net.